Yeah. We got to look for a new preacher. <sighs> I got to find a new church. Just when this church got new again. Yeah. Keep, keep on thinking of it as new. Hmm? Keep on thinking of it as new. Maybe new? you'll wear a robe this week and it'll be something new. Don will wear a robe? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> He looks really cute in his robe, too. I mean, from a very manly point of view. I showed him pictures of the wedding the other day. and uh, Three. Well, yeah. hello there. Oh. We're already, we were already live. Yeah, what you said was live. No. You were wearing, 100%. You were wearing a robe. Yes. At the wedding. In the wedding, yeah. yeah. But only in the wedding. Like, only during the service, not, it came not right off. afterwards. And yeah. you got the sweater on today and a shirt and no tie. Like in here, you? when you do the service, you could wear your robe and then take it off after the service. <laughs> I could do that's, that. That's yeah. how that works, Which yeah. Which service? You mean the uh, worship service? Worship service. I worship could do service. that. Yeah. I could do that. Actually, read today's... You know what, you what most preachers do. Read today's... Uh, most... Well, you know what you could do? Uh, not anymore. You could make 830 no robe, 11 robe. I could. I'm just, it's just as cool. you know, it move is, towards, you know, move towards it. You know. yeah, yeah, as I get yeah. old, as I get older, I get more ease into it. Ease into I could, it. I could. I mean, this is uh, Wednesday, January thirty first. This wow, is Cannonsburg, huh? End of the month. It doesn't get any more end of the month than today. Thirty one days, half September, November, April, June, and November. Amber. All the rest have thirty one, except for. January. February. I don't because know. Because February is nuts and everybody knows I, I February is nuts. Anyway, here we are. This is Cannonsburg UP Church. Too. Huh? Don't forget, it's going to be a leap year this year. Is it this year? We have 29 days 29 in February. 29 days in February. Well. Yep. That's amazing. So the people born on the 29th get to actually celebrate their birthday. They do. Yeah. I don't know if I'd like that or not like that. Well, this you... is Cannonsburg UP Church. <laughs> At Cannonsburg, PA. Pastor Don. Ken Clink. Al Barker. And uh, Alvin. Since there was nobody on the video when we went live and just talking, it's all right. Nobody's going to watch that very first well, part. Well, they, they pick it up anyhow. You know, no, I know. Do you that. think people are going to start over? Maybe. No, I mean, they, they know. They know. I, I beased our way into uh, the it. music. We've a little bit of our pre discussion. Where'd the water come from? The water came from? Yeah. Same place the uh, light from the cross came from. Magic. I don't think so. Okay, I'm gonna figure it out. When uh, I, you know, it's actually stop more. Stop playing never with that mustache. Have, never okay? would have imagined that this would be the thing that it is. But now that it is the thing that it you is, you love it. Yeah, I guess I do. Well, and yeah. we got a pastor. What you're gonna find out. We, uh, yeah, I know that. Yeah, and when I do, I'm gonna kick you. Yeah. Now That's we got a pastor here. He's growing out his mustache, his moustache, for. Vacation Bible School, yep. also known as July. Okay, this is January thirty first, and we got the walrus look going on already. Okay, what, what you, what, here's the thing: is you can't, you can't just do it overnight. I could, tr I could cut it off any time. Yeah, but I can't grow it. I didn't want to say anything about the mayonnaise yet hanging on over do here. I have, do I have some? Not anymore. Okay, good. You got it over. Good, good, good. Yeah. excellent. Yep. I was going to leave it there, but I thought that would be too terrible for you. You snatch Trust it. me, the only people who like it less than you is me. Oh, so well, yeah, good. It's right. not a. It's not. You a, like mayonnaise, so do I. Sorry. Right. Um, yeah. By the way, isn't it funny? Um, you don't know this on screen, like when you're watching TV, but you know newscasters and anyway, they have to sit like super close to each other, like yeah, they do, like in such a close proximity that you would never do that in real life. Sometimes you do. I think I think they wear those earpieces. Yes. Okay, and I and I always feel the producer saying. Hey, you got to move a little bit closer yeah. to the center. You're getting into it. Cause yeah. you, see, you see them you know, oh, moving oh, every oh, once in a while just oh, for, yeah. for no good reason. I move think. into the picture. You know, or smile a little bit more. In fact, or, I'm you, guessing you, you have me out of the picture altogether. Totally. I could not imagine having somebody in your ear constantly saying something. Oh, never mind. I can. Yeah, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know that they're always talking. No, I but, think they, they, limit, they have to limit their – because, yeah, that would be tough to talk and listen at the same time. It would be. It, but unless you're trained to do that, next to impossible. No, I, you know, I. Can you were tapping that. my shoulder. You want to say something? Um, no, I, yeah, I did, but yeah, you forgot. I wanted to say something in your ear. Ah, okay. in your in your ear. So I think we should definitely highlight. Why one are you thing. rolling these up? You can go you get to work. work. You get work. So, oh. um, 
something exciting. Something exciting. Something exciting in the mail shortly. Oh. Maybe by the end of the week. It's Wednesday. Today is possible that they could be received Ooh. by the end of the week. Who who is? Invitations, like like formal invitation. No, no, no. Like it's an invitation. Wow. No RSVP required. I figured it was going to be some tax document that you know shows how much you donated to the church last year. Th those are probably going out. I'm pretty sure yeah. those are those are also going out. Yeah. Um, but uh, no, no formal invitations. Beautiful, embossed, blue gold White. writing. Beautiful. Anyway, they're going out in the mail. So, uh, if well, February are, 25th, I would say this, if we have your address, you should be expected to be getting so what, one. What's going on at the service? At February 25th, Ooh, good, yeah. good, at four o'clock in the afternoon, mm -hmm. here in our sanctuary. So, what, what are we doing? Are we having an, is it a worship service? Uh -huh. What's, what? Uh, you know what I say, don't you? Huh. Let them eat cake. Yeah. We're going to eat cake? Let the them eat. Oh, there'll be cake. No, not in the sanctuary. There, there a are nice, a nice cake. There are light refreshments downstairs in the fellowship hall following the service. Yes. So I guess I think um, a yeah service of celebration. So they will there will be there will be music both both sung uh, as a congregation but also anthems. Um, there will be uh, some sharing of. Uh, both memories, the story of how we got here. There'll be some video and some photographs that will be shared. Um, and then we are going to have people um, from our past and our present who will be participating. Cannonsburg UP Church, this is your nice. life. Yeah. So I think it's going to be exciting. We, um, I have reached out to nearly everyone that is alive and uh, participated um, that were like on uh, a minister that was uh, yeah. in the life of the church over the past 30 years. Um, got a lot of responses. Um, some people. And how many of them is there? How many, how many past pastors? How many well, past we had pastors a are still there was a time we had associates like a dozen. Too. from this church. No kidding. In some capacity. Yeah. So, wow. so there was, you know, youth ministers. Um, right, right. And, um, and then there were some, there were some positions Oh, what what were they what were they called? Associates. Um, yeah, no, 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 no. Um, interim. Yeah, there's some there's some interims, but there I, I can't remember exactly what it was called. But um, uh, we didn't call it a assistant. They, they moved on to some other stuff. So uh, Linda Mankey and uh, Gary Gibson um, both served here. They right. since went on uh, to be ordained and served in other churches in our presbytery. But I believe while they were here, they were. Some other kind of capacity. Yeah. Assistant, maybe not associate. Yeah, they, see, they got rid of assistant at one point in time. Well, anyway. maybe, anyway, yeah. So a lot, a lot, Now, Gary cool. was here before Linda. It was Gary, then Linda. Yes. he. I talked to him, yeah. and he said, I um, I handed it off to my sister, mm -hmm. and I told him, because I told him I had to call her first. <laughs> She's older. So, you know, I had, to, I had to give her the respect that she was due by calling her. Then I immediately called Gary, even though he was here first. You know. He was here first. Yeah. I was mad at him when he left. Yeah. Did yeah. you like him? I liked him then. Yeah. I don't not so much. No. Once he left, you didn't like him. <laughs> That's, that sounds that sounds about right. No, I like him anyhow. Yeah, Ken's about to not like me too. So. <laughs> a little bit closer. Yeah, every day. Well, I'm just so anyway. I think it's going to be a really exciting service. Oh, I do too. Music, um, a whole bunch of stuff, and then of course, and we and and members of the community, you are invited. Yes. You don't need to get an invitation. But here it is. Some will be going out, so that'll be fun. Great, too. that's great. And behind that door, that right door right there. Now we're working on the historical room. Yes, I think I think it's going to be called the historical gallery. They are working on it, and hopefully by the end of the month, we will be in a really good space to have it displayed. And downstairs, we're going to have a whole bunch of cool stuff. But you know, what we realized this is where I was actually going. What we realized, of course, next year is the two hundred and fiftieth. Wow, another party. So we're going to have to get on it right now. Fall of 2025, we're going to have to have another big party. Another big party. Another big party. You might now, be out of the camera now, just to let you know. Voice on the look, screen, I don't know. Let me tell you okay. about this room over here. Yep. Here's my thoughts on it. We need to get a big neon sign above it. Like, you know, on the cornflake box, it says Kellogg's. Okay, yeah. How yeah, it's it red. And, Kellogg's No, there? Canton's. Oh, Can't that's touch. what we're doing for the piano. Oh, you are? Mm-hmm. You're going to have it lit? Mm -hmm. Like the cross is lit? Just like you. 
lit. I'm a not lit. Uh, yeah, that's I've the been, plan. We're gonna, you know we're what the problem under, is? I've been smoking cigarettes from Romania. Oh, geez. Here that's we go. That's what it again. is. Here it's we the go. The Romanian cigarettes. They got my. Get it out. Go ahead. Go I, ahead. I can't help myself. I, I, the Romanian cigarette that Kathy, she bought me back. I looked at the pack because they look different. And so I read it. And here they were made in the mother country. Kenton Ken got the bargain on cigarettes. Romania. Mm hmm. So they look different, but I'm, off, I smoke. $60 off a cart. And so, and I, Romania. here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to relocate back to, I've been called back to my homeland in Romania. Germany. Romania. I'm, and, I'm pretty sure Clink is German, not no, Romanian. No, no, no. We, we were very close to the border. So I'm, I've been called back to the Netherlands, to the motherlands. Okay. And I, um, I'm going to go back there and eat potatoes and drink vodka. So anyway, she wanted to talk about <laughs> th th things in our life, the things that we're going, things that are going on. So, uh, we just started a new Bible study last week and a very interesting topic. The topic yeah. is about near death experiences, Ooh. or as I said, near life experiences. I kept on saying it wrong. Oh, and, cool. And, 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 you know, hold on a second. But, that's a cool way to think about it. That is. It, it, well, Keep I, going though, so I don't want to just derail. So I just found it amazing just reading the first few chapters of the book of how many near life experiences there actually is, and the recollection of people who have had near death experiences, how similar their stories are. Yeah, they're extremely similar yeah. to the details about looking down a tunnel, about seeing a bright light, about coming out of their body and being up on the ceiling watching. People trying to revive them on their table. And I'm not just one person who said that. It's 50 people who have had the same story about their near-death near 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 experiences. Experience. It's just amazing. So um, that 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 is really cool. I, I have not done too much reading. I've done a little bit, not much. But I know someone... If you guys, you should pass this along. I know someone who really, this is kind of like one of their, I don't know, specialties, hobbies in a sense. Uh, he's a pastor, uh, now uh, is the director of a, 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 a counseling uh, center. Uh, he's preached here a couple of times. Who, if it's what you guys, if it's something you might like, I bet he'd be willing to like. Talk to us. I bet he would. I mean, so talk, talk to your small group and see if there's uh, yeah, um, Graham Graham Standish. Um, and there was there was one item that that we read about John. John in the Bible, mm -hmm. I believe it was John. What had a near life experience? He was stoned and put to death. Paul. And, oh, Paul. Paul. It was Paul. Yeah. Paul. Yeah. He was mm -hmm. stoned and put to death, and he had a. Near death like experience, the, the and then he got up and he third was back, heaven. and it was back, went to the third heaven and came and came back. Is to that town. what he called it? Third and, heaven. That's what he ref, yeah, and refers we're to. all looking at each other, going, you know, how comes we've never heard this before yeah. in, any, in any of the sermons and, or readings about the Bible? That's that's a pretty big deal. I'll tell you why. And in his near death experience was very how it was described in the Bible mm -hmm. was very similar. In some aspects, to other people's, you know, you know what? There's two reasons why I would say. One, Paul mentions it kind of in passing, as as like a because um, he's he's kind of downplaying his own authority, and he's talking about himself in the third person. Yeah. So he's kind of. But the second thing is, most people don't know what to do with it. So like, I right. don't know what to. I, what am I supposed to? I don't know. I right. guess we'll just we'll read it and pretend we didn't read it, and we'll just keep going. Right. So I think that's why. But well, it's one of the questions that came up was. Um, uh, why are we hearing so much about near-death experience these days? And okay. is it occurring more now than it used to? And maybe with medical technology, it, it maybe is happening more often, but maybe it's happening more often because it's a way of people to come back and tell about their experience of meeting God. Yeah. Uh, first, first-hand experience of meeting God and being able to tell others, just like when Jesus came, God brought Jesus here so that Mankind could what was actually the word? meet him in meet what was him the in word? person. What was the word? Dawn's word for the week. Oh, you weren't here that week. Uh, and kenosis. Uh, that was the so, you know, and maybe it's occurring more now because uh, 
God wants more more people to have that experience so they can spread firsthand experiences to other people. That's cool. My mother's yeah. last words were, Darla, look, it's beautiful. Yeah. Um, so, and that, I'm sure, is goes along with a lot of the things sure. that you've... Yeah. I, uh, yeah, I... I, I think it's nice for Christians to get together and talk about that from a Christian viewpoint and not just a hokey spirit, ghostly viewpoint, you know. Um, so we're just, we're just the first week into it. And it's about six weeks or cool. seven weeks. Oh, and we'll, see, right. we'll see how it goes. Right, here, I'll, I'll here. report back later. That's what you got to do. Yeah. So each one of these, you got to give us a little mini update yeah. on, on, on what you're doing, what you're. Now uh, don't have a near death experience. No, no. I mean, near near death is all right. It means he came back, right? No, eh. but if you're having a near death experience, dude, you're sick. Not necessarily. Well, sure you are. I have a near death experience every time you pick up the guitar on Sunday. Every time I, every yeah. time you ride in the car with me, and every time like, I get in the car with him, he goes all the way to the right. <laughs> I'm telling you, I don't you know, like riding on the white line. Oh, he rides. Oh, oh I'm on the white line. He's over the edge. Oh, <laughs> I never had anything. And he won't get in my car, of course, because I smoke cigarettes from a oh, Romanian. It smells like cool, cool Romanian cigarettes. Now. Yeah, but I, I no smoke. You know, when he first came here, we did a funeral. And I, I had a different car back then, of course. And maroon. No, no, it was the cream colored Lincoln Continental. Well, that was the cream one. Yeah, that little short one. He goes through cars every two years. That little he can't, uh, can't keep little up with them. Lincoln, uh, uh, I can't remember. Then the maroon. Then, then the, the yes. Okay. But we, I drove him up to the cemetery uh, because it, I just thought it was nice that I do that, and I smoked the whole time. He didn't complain then. Okay, it's not until after till he came. Till he was assimilated into our lives, like that he say, decided. No, he probably walked into his house, and his wife said, "Oh, you stink! You better take a shower, and change your clothes." The well, number of times that I disrobed immediately after stepping in, and the clothes went right into it. I'm like, "I'm not doing this again." There's a church not, member. A headache is not worth it. There's a church member. He shall remain nameless. Okay. That puts on special clothes to come to my house. I believe it. That makes sense. It makes a lot of sense. Not bio like hazmat. Not, no, not biohazard or anything, but yeah, I've seen the same flannel plastic, shirt. Plastic, flannel, flannel. So, yeah, but uh, yeah, he's the same way. Yeah, and and then of course when I had a visit last week, I said, "Well, it doesn't smell like smoke in here today." So, so you just assume that it always smells every like smoke. single time I've ever no. been assaulted by my. No, that's a not true. You just don't notice it anymore. Hmm? You just don't notice it anymore. You, you think? Get, you get accustomed to the smell and you don't notice it. I've grown accustomed to the yeah. smell. Yeah, same thing. Same thing. Accustomed to your face. So, um, yes. last week we last ordained week. and installed officers. Oh, we did. One, One of the highlights of my year. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's always fun. You know I love that service. I know you do. This Sunday... We, uh, um, this we, uh, we're going to communion. Uh, communion. Oh, and yeah. The next Sunday, biggest, best Sunday of the year. Congregational Annual meeting. Annual congregation wow. meeting. Wow. That is big time Presbyterian. Big time. Wow. Decently and, and in order. Wow. And now, let's how, look how many at this. people have to be, how, what's a quorum do you have to have? Uh, I believe it's 10% of the membership. You so, know what? I've uh, never been to a congregational meeting ever. Where they said there's not a quorum. Okay. <laughs> so, always a quorum. Just curious. There's always a yeah. quorum. What the number was supposed yeah. to be. You know, yeah. I think, I think, I think, yeah, I think, 10, I think we're really about 60 people. So, okay. so, so should we have anything, should be anything, um, uh, we, we're not, we're not making changes to our bylaws. Uh, we will, the, the one slightly out of the ordinary. What'd you do? We do have to, we're adding, and this is great news. But we're uh, bringing one last nominee for the nominating committee. Oh, thank like you. The one I, I'm so glad thing. they decided to. And we vote on the budget too. No, no session took care of the budget. Done. done. You we vote on my terms it. of call. So, oh, so okay. now you get to say yay or nay. So say yay or nay. Fourteen. See, yay or nay. Not yes, yes or, or no. no. So, so this could be my second last video with you. It could be. I could be. <laughs> you know. 
two weeks from now on on Valentine's Day, Ash Wednesday. You know, I don't have a Valentine. You don't have a Valentine. Uh -uh. Ashes. Ashes. They they will be your. Oh, that's Ash Wednesday. Ash Wednesday. So I'm gonna come home with a cross on my. There you go. You know what? When you put that on the side of the heart, I was gonna say we do a heart on my forehead. Okay. God's love. I mean, uh, okay, yeah. I you know what I always say, right? Do you what? know what I? You, do you what know do what you I always say? say? Uh. Well done. That what do you always say? Uh. uh. <laughs> That's true. Uh. Especially if he's multitasking. <laughs> Forget it. Okay. And now he's got this new watch, so he has the new watch to play with. I can. I can. I can. Yeah. Yeah. It's here's trouble. here's what I don't get. You do, you're you're up here doing your sermon. Mm hmm. And you don't say ah one single time. Right? I don't really. You don't. You, you know you, why? You go through your whole prepared sermon, and yeah. I'm sure it changes from time to time, and oh. and you're just going by memory of what you wanted to talk about, yeah. and and, mm -hmm. and you do a very good job, and you practically don't say ah, but when you're reading the announcements or saying yeah. something off, off to the, the to the audience to the congregation, Two you'll put time. ah in a sentence ten times. Yeah. You do that, and I, you know, we're not criticizing and, and, you. And Scott, I hate the announcements. It's, I hate you. <laughs> but you're, it's, you're it's, good at it. It's amazing what a difference it is when you do your sermon. Mm -hmm. it, it's now, long. let me tell you, it's, it's, we you had know, a conversation. You should if, re, you know, look at the next time you watch it. Yeah, oh, it's, that, I can't that. do that. That's going to be so painful. We, uh, <laughs> we had a congregation member that's, who no longer is with us, but uh, counted the number of times you used to say honest. That I used to. Mm -hmm. Who was that? I can't say. Oh, right. because I feel like I only... Lee. Hmm? Lee. Mm. Oh, oh, um, it was no longer with us. I thought you meant it was dead. <laughs> I thought you meant they're dead. You could no. share with me. Oh, Lee. Hey, Lee. That's all right. He does, he, he's not watching. I had, I've had lots of, uh, um, corrective, um, comments over the years about different things. About I've only had uh, one. And about, some other things. Guns. I, I don't remember if I... Uh, I don't know whether you... About, I, I'm thinking more about, not about content, oh. but about style. Style. You have none. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. You have no style. Spoken. You're Canadian. Coming, coming from the so man... So what's your favorite word? What you were getting, you were getting to what's your favorite word? Or what do you say all the time? Which, yeah, what do you say all the That's time? That's what started us all off. And I yeah. said, oh, now I have no idea. See? What do I... Catch? Sorry for interrupting wow. you. Wow. I had totally... See? You are right. He did what, say that. I, what I say you all the time. Yeah, what do you say all the time? I feel like that was a passing, one of those passing notes to get me to what I really was going to say. Mm -hmm. And I have See? zero clue. And you know what did that to your mind? Texting. <laughs> Let that be a note. Stop I'm, the texting. <laughs> I don't know how that came to about, but sure, okay. Well, and we talked at lunch today about your watch. You could have recorded it. I don't know. If you it, know, could we do the video with your watch? No, there's no camera on it. Oh, uh, darn. I'm could, sorry. Could, this could be an all audio program. Oh, no, no. We have to stay video. Okay. Keep people <clears throat> keep people interested. It's because you They're know. not tuning in to look at me. Now, so today is or the 30th. you. Today is the 31st of January. 31st of January. So next Wednesday month. will be the 7th of February. Mm -hmm. We will be at 11 o'clock. Yes. 11 o'clock because Walrus Face here has Ministerium Association. Right down the street at Fresh Start Cafe. I was going to call Al's Pick Up and Go. Uh, Fresh Start Cafe. Yeah. Right down there. And we have to change our whole schedule. No, you don't have to. Well, we, you want to skip the video of that. But you just, can skip but the just video think afterwards we can go out to lunch. I know we do that. It's our so special time. Go. I know that. It's my turn to buy. <laughs> yeah. Nice. My turn. I need, go somewhere nice. We do kings. <laughs> oh. With a coconut cream pie. Okay. They don't have it all the time. Not nearly as good as Al's. Al's coconut. No, not nearly as good as Al's coconut cream pie. No. Nope. No, he makes a dynamite cook the cream pie. I think, though, at one point I was going to mention we were having communion this Sunday. Oh, communion this Sunday? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Now, you know, I I meant to talk to you about the time of the service. Now, you knew last week. The time of what service? The time, the how long you expect someone to endure worship. 
endure worship. Well, I'm going to tie this. If, 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 it, <laughs> if endure worship is what is, I would say, man, I think you got to. You got to not be coming if you're only enduring it. Well, here should be a joyful place to well, gather here's, together. Here's and what happened. And- here's what happened is that last week mm-hmm. we had all that extra stuff going on. Yeah, and you still took your twenty minutes. Okay, so it was quarter after. Quarter after. Quarter after twelve. You it was quarter leave. to ten. You no, I have to work. Yeah, He's got to have cigarettes on the hour or every hour. You know, you know what? Last yeah. time I almost got up and went. It's almost two. It's been almost two hours for him right now. I can't believe it. You mean almost two hours since you've had a cigarette? I know it. We're pushing hour. <sighs> Those Romanians last. Can Those we Romanian stop talking about it? Okay. Oh, now all of a sudden you're starting to get fidgety. <laughs> I think the people here are. I mean. You go to a movie, right? Two hours. I can't believe I'm the old guy saying, say, saying, you know, I still sucking smoke, up for an hour and fifteen. I minutes. still smoke in the bathroom. What, at the what's movies. the rush, anyways, to get uh, out of here at precisely? At, oh, there's no rush. I'm not rushed. Them. Well, that's when I. Uh, there's no rush. I wasn't talking about it, except my new cigarettes were made in Romania. <laughs> um, no, I, I. There he goes again with the hand on the head. Uh, so what else do we got going on? So we got on Valentine's Day is also Ash Wednesday. And we also have an Ash Wednesday service. So mark your calendars. If you got no plans, even if you do have plans, you can always change them. We got you and your sweetheart can come to church Six first. o'clock, soup supper, seven o'clock service. Yep. 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 Because, you know, life is like a bike, box of chocolates. With Ken, you never know what you're going to get. Yeah. Life is like a box of chocolates. Run, Donnie, run. I th- I'm thinking about it. I'm seriously <laughs> considering I'm, this. I'm, I'm kind of interested to hear what the music sounds like Me today. too, yeah, yeah. The so music? You got any what? plans for music today? Today? Yeah. You got anything to share? Oh, uh, well, I'm I got... ready. So... I, <laughs> I got something. I'll, I'll, I'll pull out... Uh, no, I'll, don't. I'll pull... No, they don't want to hear we you can, We can... Uh, I, you know, I was playing in my office because I'm preparing for the winter retreat. I wouldn't know about uh, winter here retreats. I, uh, here, here I, I am, Lord. Lord. Yeah, I pulled that out. Yeah? That actually sounds really good on guitar. If you say so. Easy. Yeah. Well, it's only you only pay four chords. Come on. Nope. Um, I've never I mean, been. I five. Never been to the winter retreat because somebody has to Do you want to go? Somebody has to Do you want to go? Somebody want to go? I'll play Here <laughs> I Am, Lord, with you. Excellent. There you go. Yes. You want to go? Yeah. Okay, come. Well, who's going to play? Yeah, we'll figure it'll it out. Be, it'll be Megan and Dan. Okay. There what if Megan know. wants to go and take the kids? Uh, does Megan want to come? She can come. I don't know. We'll figure it out. She probably we'll hire somebody in. Hire somebody. Acapella. There is nobody to come. hire in. Al's coming. Al and Linda are going. I'm sure they are. Does the two of you got any of the grandkids coming with you? I don't know. Okay. Other, you know so. what I'm going to do that week? Because he lives in a log cabin. I'm going to stay at his house over the weekend. Nice. Build a fire. Very good. Yep. Fire's smoke, going right now. Could smoke burn cigarettes. It, could burn it down. You can't smoke cigarettes inside. You I can't. Go on the front porch. Well, if you don't see me, you don't know. <laughs> oh, you think Linda won't notice? <laughs> That's where you're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I can hear her now. I can hear her now. Mm. She, I could hear her from where she is. Yep. Hey, yeah. um, by the way, one, one last. But you know what? You smoke your meat sometimes. Totally. So different. why yeah, can't that with nicotine? Different, different, different smoke. Not with nicotine. And I'll tell her I smoked and the that's ham. That's outside too. Oh. Um, hey, by the way, one last thing. I one think, last I think thing. You're gonna like, I think you're gonna like this. What? We're working on. I, I can't. I can't give you a, a date yet. For my annual, my okay. great fiftieth anniversary celebration. No. The what? Uh, no. Uh, my fiftieth anniversary celebration. Something you might like. Celebrating more. fifty years of my service here at Kansas. Fifty Burton years UC. of clink. A clink. Fifty years of clinking around. I've only known him ten years. Yeah, that's ten years too many. Um, but uh, you only know me ten years. You're right. Yep. I knew of you before that. No, you didn't. I came in with. Uh, word gets around. <laughs> I don't I came in funny. like. I didn't. You. I wasn't here for whenever you. Uh, when no, you, you were. No, I wasn't. One hundred percent. I don't remember you. <laughs> <laughs> I came here with my wife and my kids and preached. And I was here? You who else was here? Well, I think I might have been taking that day off. You didn't. You don't anyway. take you don't take days. I know that, I know. 
Um, I'm jonesing for one right now. All right, so we'll take one. No, I, 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 we're busy this month. We vacation. And we're busy this vacation. month. Okay. We got Easter next Nobody's month. Nobody's watching. Yes, they are. Kathy. You're just hearing. So, Cheryl is. Here we, here, here we go. If it's broadcasting, something, okay. something cool. This is the, we got plans for this. Here we go. We got plans. We're working. We're hoping that they'll see the light of day shortly. Cannonsburg UP Church Spirit Gear. Spirit Gear? That's right. We're going to have our own line of clothing. Imagine having t shirt, sweater. You know, this dude will do anything hats. for a costume. I've got one that says got, got Church. Imagine having people with Got Church All of them. shirts. I told you it was a good idea. So. So we need to be on the lookout for this when we can finally announce it available uh, for purchase. But uh, we're hoping that uh, in um, w with this celebration service that we can in, in conjunction with that. But also one of the is things, my picture going to be on it because it says God Church. Do you want to sell these things? <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll probably end up giving them away anyway. If, if your face is on it, uh, can't even do that. Um, but also what new website oh new website is, is close just a few little tweaks yeah don't go there now ah you could go there now it's just yeah yeah go, you can go there to watch our videos on the website no no new format new format look, you know updated content you still go to still at same address you pc same address yeah. and, and it's a, i'll tell you it's when a, you open up it just looks different yeah yeah okay. it's, i'll tell you it's a lot cheaper to raise your hands to raise a new, uh, um, I was just looking to raise to raise down to the studs and rebuild a website than it is an entire church. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, we know that. Yeah. Anyway, got church? Get church right here at Cannonsburg. Let's get some music. Church. Perfect timing. Well, you have to know when to say it. Yeah. That's why I came up with it. That's right. You use it. I use it anytime. Sit, sit. I. I've had it with him. Okay, <laughs> had it. I haven't been inside his house since Christmas Day. Darn. No dinner, no invitation to dinner. Huh. Not even a chance to say no, okay? Not that I would ever say no. Bye-bye now. We'll be right back.